Hey guys, welcome back to Clownfish TV. This is Neon, and we have breaking news about Justin Roiland from Rick and Morty. He's been fired. Adult Swim is severing ties with Rick and Morty co-creator Justin Roiland uh, after domestic violence charges against him became public. There are a lot of allegations against him, a lot of people coming forward. I've seen a lot of alleged DMs. And again, look, I do not want to accuse someone of stuff unless it's been proven in court that they were actually doing these things, right? We've seen before that there have been false allegations against people. You know, obviously Johnny Depp being one of the, the big cases, right? But there's a lot of stuff that doesn't look very good in regards to Justin Roiland. So we're going to talk about this in general. Again, my personal opinions, keeping them out of it. Uh, I'm not really a huge Rick and Morty fan, but again, uh, you know, this is this is pretty big news. So we're going to talk about it before we get into it any further. Please subscribe for more pop culture news views and rants, guys. Uh, over 289, almost uh, almost 290,000 subs. Thank you for the support. We do talk a lot about the animation industry, a lot of uh, big changes happening in the animation industry, uh, especially over at Warner Brothers. And yeah, so... Uh, Justin Roiland is is basically canceled. He's being he's being uh, ousted from Adult Swim. They're cutting ties with him. They're going to recast his roles. Dan Harmon is going to remain on to oversee. So apparently, you can make uh, you know some jokes. You can make jokes about uh, uh, you know abusing dolls. I think that's what Dan Harmon did. I don't know. But uh, Roiland is out. Uh, coming from the Hollywood Reporter, Adult Swim cuts ties with Justin Roiland following domestic abuse charges. Rick and Morty is set to continue with Roiland's voice roles to be recast. Sources say Adult Swim has ended its relationship with Justin Roiland in the wake of the news that the Rick and Morty co-creator was charged with felony domestic abuse in Orange County. Adult Swim has ended its association with Justin Roiland. Adult Swim Cartoon Network Boomerang SVP Communications Marie, Marie Moore said in a statement on Tuesday, Adult Swim distributes Rick and Morty, the hit adult animation comedy that Roiland co-created and for which he voiced both Rick and Morty. As the Hollywood, well, that's kind of a loss, right? Uh, John K. anybody, John K. People were bringing up John K. before. And uh, yeah, I mean, he's that, that goes back years uh, that he has had some, some skeletons in his closet. Uh, the Re Hollywood Reporter reported on January 17th, Adult Swim isn't even halfway through a massive 70-episode order commissioned by the channel in 2018. Sources say Rick and Morty is set to continue with Roiland's voice roles to be recast. Co-creator Dan Harmon will now be the sole creator. The show is locked in through season 10. On January 12th, NBC News was the first to break the news that Roiland was charged with domestic violence in Orange County based on an alleged 2020 incident. Again, Alleged, and there is, I'm sure, more to come on this. Here's the official Adult Swim Twitter. Uh, Adult Swim has ended its association with Justin Roiland. Rick and Morty will continue. The talented and dedicated crew are hard at work at season seven. So, yeah, three more seasons without Roiland. Um, just kill it. Rick and Morty is not going to be the same without Roiland. That's like getting rid of Seth MacFarlane from Family Guy. Uh, probably not untrue. But again, I'm not yet. Look, I've watched some Rick and Morty. I'm going to tell you the truth. I am not a huge fan. Uh, I really am not. But, um, you know, this is one of one of the biggest stories that come out of the animation in the last uh, year or so. But it does seem like there are a lot of people in animation that are accused of doing a lot of different things. And now, again, we don't know if it's true or not true. I have seen some DMs. I've seen some alleged DMs and texts and that sort of thing. Um, and, but people have been falsely accused before. So, you know, we don't know, wait till it goes to court and see what happens. Uh, Phantom wire has it. Everybody's talking about it. Um, just Royland's lawyers before court. Don't use the voice. Don't use the voice. So this is coming from, we got this covered and they're basically talking about what happens if Royland gets gone, uh, which characters are going to get, going to get replaced. Um, so they're talking about uh, Kanye West and, and comparing Kanye West to J.K. Rowling. Rick and Morty co-creator Justin Roiland is the latest celebrity being put through the ringer for good reason. For good reason, everybody. Uh, right up there with that uh, infamous uh, uh, J.K. Rowling. <laughs> Having risen to fame after Rick and Morty became an adult swim sensation in 2013. Has it been that long? Roiland had been riding high for the past decade prior to co-creating Ram. 
Ram. He had been a prominent voice actor, lending his talents on many cartoons, including Adventure Time and Gravity Falls. Once he became a recognizable name among Adult Swim audiences, he was soon crowned Nerd Culture King. From there, he began developing independent video games with his trademark voice and self-aware, raunchy humor. He landed a separate creative deal for Hulu with uh, Solar Opposites, which I have not seen. The ghosts of his past returned to haunt him when he was arrested on domestic violence charges. Those stem from a 2020 incident, and he is now awaiting trial, which should take place in April. Again, we don't know what's going to happen, if he's going to be convicted or not. Uh, if that weren't bad enough, more allegations have since come to light. He made reprehensible comments about underage girls during a podcast interview and his vile direct messages with different women that reportedly included those to a 16 year old have been made public. I have seen that. I mean, yeah, it's hard. If those are legit, it's really hard to, uh, to make excuses for that. Right. What was once a beloved writer, producer and voice actor has officially fallen from grace uh, Roland's alleged actions have shredded his public image and it's left a noticeable stain on anything with his name attached to it, among other things. Uh, fans are heading to the exits and droves and it leaves everything connected to him in doubt. Here are his other shows. So when he gets canceled, here's what could potentially get canceled or recast. Solar Opposites, I, I would say they'd probably just cancel it. I don't know. Um, you know, it's uh, Two Girls, One Cup, The Show. Another one that could get get gone high on life. What are they going to do? Just like record all, re-record all his lines? I mean, what are you supposed to do? Some other stuff he's in. Trover. Uh, Trover saves the universe. Accounting. I haven't seen this one. Uh, Koala Man. Yeah, it goes on and on and on. Look, he's, he's done, guys. He's probably done. Um, unless he pulls a Johnny Depp and is able to prove that he's innocent. Uh, I don't know. I don't know, guys. So here is is one account of uh, a Justin Roiland uh, meeting. So Justin Roiland has been trending, according to Jill Keaton, animator at Titmouse. I was an animator on Rick and Morty briefly in 2013. Justin assigned me the daunting task of animating this scene. He, I told him that I didn't want to because of my history of being an SA survivor. And Justin told me to shut up or I'll make you munch on my carpet, bitch. Wow. I couldn't believe it. The room was in shock. I spent the whole day crying, but none of us could say anything. Justin was the hot new meal ticket. If we said anything, we'd be out of a job. I'm glad we got to speak out. Finally, uh, F Rick and Morty was one of the worst experiences of my career. Lots of stories like this. Like what, guys? I can't say whether this stuff happened or didn't happen. He's going to get his day in court. But uh, Adult Swim washing their hands of him, which I am surprised. I honestly thought that given how popular Rick and Morty is, this one would get swept under the rug. But... Apparently not. Apparently uh, anybody can be canceled, including the showrunner, uh, including the, the star of the show. Ask Roseanne how that goes. Uh, so there it is. We'll keep you updated. Please subscribe for more pop culture news, views, and rants, and we'll talk later.